Operatives of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps have been charged with the need to maintain a high level of discipline and good working ethics. The Assistant Commandant General gave the charge during the passing out parade of the 2019-2022 batch of the NSCDC recruits at the Edo State Command of the Agency. Clearview TV correspondent in Benin City, Nafisa Bello, completes the report. Delivering the speech of the Assistant Commandant General of Zone G, Zonal Command Benin, Shoaib Jiburil, Commandant Richard Fasasi, commended the Edo State Command of the Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, NICDC, for their efforts day in, day out to ensure that the training was accomplished. I must give credit to the CG, NSCDC, and the training crew of Edo State Command of NSCD, which has redeemed this church period, transformed total and mutual disservice men and women to the end product which we see before us today. From the report I received from the state commandant on their training and the parade we witnessed today, there's ample evidence that this old UB officer have been put through the maze and have come out refined and ready to contribute their quota to the NSCD effort of preserving the national security of our nations. I command you to avail yourself with the approved standard operating procedure, SOP, condition of service, code of conduct as it applies to NSCDC. At this juncture, I congratulate you all for going through this rigorous training and enjoying the difficulties associated with such training. In his address, the Edo State Commandant of the NACDC, Samuel Dan, said the exercise is part of the vision of the Commandant General to restructure the agency as well as to reposition the officers to meet the security challenges facing the country. While on behalf of other security agencies present at the occasion, the Commander for Brigade Nigerian Army, Brigadier General Sani Abdullahi, advised the graduates on the need to synergize with operatives of sister security agencies, as no one agency can do it alone. What we are witnessing today is in line with the vision of our Commandant General, Dr. Ahmed Abubakar Audi, MNI, to strategically restructure, accentuate, and reposition the core to better tackle evolving security challenges. For the graduates, I want to make mention of the fact that uh, as you step out into the field, there is still training on the job to be done. What does this call for? Synergy and cooperation among the security agencies. It is worthy of note that the 2019-2022 batch of the NACDC recruits have been fully groomed and drilled in unarmed combat, internal security operations, paramilitary ethics, intelligence gathering, critical national asset protection, disaster management, and private guards companies registration and duties. Nafisa Bello, reporting for Clairview Television.